Hey everybody, Rifter here, and before I start off this commentary, I just want everyone to listen to this opening line from this engineer right as we go out here. Good this news, shit boys. is hilarious. I drafted up a blueprint of the other team's asses, and it looks like all oh, our boots are gonna fit up there. You, you might have heard that before, but honestly, I, I haven't heard it since I came back to the game, and that wasn't a thing three years ago, and I think that's absolutely hilarious. At least I've never heard that line before from an engineer. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, this is actually going to be the first engineer gameplay that I did, or that I'm doing on this channel. Uh, back when I played like TF2 like like three years ago, like, since I've come back to the game, I always used to think of engineer, I don't really know what I would classify him as, just kind of like an extra role. It didn't really like have a purpose in my mind, it was just like kind of like a defensive role. Um, but now that I've played him again, um, after playing like support in Dota 2, I feel that he very much is a support. Uh, he's there to help your team and facilitate and like be that more like strategic mind and like think about like placements of things and provide a safety blanket for your team, if that makes sense. I know there's a lot of like jumble cross kind of all at once there, but basically he's there to like support the team um, and provide them with something to fall back to. Uh, teleports up to the front and all that stuff is very important to making the game easier for the rest of your teammates on the soldiers on the demos the scouts uh, Even your snipers and your spies providing them with you know safer areas or backup plans and just different different things um, It's not just the mindless like oh, I'm sitting behind my Sentry that's in a good spot and right clicking it over and over and over again and People are just getting teleported to the front lines and I hope a spy doesn't show up. It's not really like that I've been playing and this is obviously a mini century gameplay, but I've been playing a lot more of just like regular engineer as well, and it really is a support class. There's a lot more that goes into it than just the things that I said. There's a lot of strategy and understanding when to move your buildings or uh, being aware of spies. There's lots of like little like maintenance kind of things that are very much like support roles. Um, and I normally play like support kind of classes and heroes or characters or whatever you want to call them. Uh, whenever I play video games. I'm much more, I, I don't want to say that I like crack under pressure in high stress situations, but it definitely like will affect like my aim and my gameplay if it's like, like a tournament or something and I'm playing. So I generally like to uh, just kind of play those roles that'll allow me to um, just like be there for my teammates and like think strategically because when you get into those like roles like soldier and scout and different things like that, it can be a lot easier. It, your mindset's much more important. And your mindset's like everything that you stand on whenever you play any video game or go into any like competitive situation is and for me, like, being able to continue thinking is very, very important to me, and, like, being able to function. Um, and some people, I think that, like, they operate better just by, like, zoning out and just, like, destroying everyone on the enemy team. Like, you, I see it, like, sometimes when I watch Banny play, he just, like, kind of zones out and just, like, talks and, like, talks about, like, what he wants to do and just, like, goes to town on people. And, like, really great players I see do that. And I just, I, I kind of just don't do that. <laughs> so, my role is support. Definitely, and I'll definitely be playing a lot more engineer because I think it falls within those like kind of parameters of things that I want to do. Um, I mean, that's pretty much it for engineer. It's just like I'm gonna have to start playing it a little bit more and like learning like when to move my sentries and just kind of feel it out and figure out how to best support my team. Um, shout out to everyone that's, uh, especially yesterday, it was kind of like a big day for the channel. I like hit up a lot of people on like, Twitter and Steam and things like that and asked for help with like thumbnails and banners and things like that. My boy Care Bear is helping me out with that and I have a guy making a banner for me right now. And you guys are going to see some hopefully pretty cool thumbnails now that I've uh, sort of somewhat learned how to use Source uh, Filmmaker. Um, it's going to be a lot of work. Definitely, but I want to like make all my own stuff myself and you know do the best that I can with this channel and just like have fun. So, um, thank you everyone who always comments on all my videos. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out, guys.